Can you hearken back mm. to your single days, you guys? Mm. Yes, it was uh, very different times back mm. then. Sky, I mean, this was black and white times. I mean, for well, you. yeah, horse <laughs> and buggy stuff. Yeah, yeah. because yeah. it's crazy. Well, when you first start dating somebody, you go through different milestones, right? Mm-hmm. And sometimes when you go through those milestones, they can be a little bit awkward. Mm. A little bit awkward. Uh-oh. Yeah, we're going to be going over dating firsts that are kind of awkward. We ain't done yet. It's time for the P1 Podcast. Fun's not over yet. Completely uncensored and un filtered. Except for that part. Looking for the after party with no end. The show's after show starts now. Can you remember the first time you felt comfortable enough to take a shit in oh, basically in the same room that your significant other is in? Oh, man. Like, that's a big milestone. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like when you go, yeah, fuck it. I'm going to go take a shit. Oh. Emily had that milestone with us yesterday. That's true. <laughs> yeah, it was huge. It was Sky! Huge. What? It, it, no, we're but, together but on this. Sky, we that, grew. Sky, Sky, Sky. What? That's not true. What? Do you remember that time she blew up the bathroom and we had a coworker walk oh, in yeah. right afterwards and he freaked out? I see, yep. but I wasn't as close to the restroom. Oh, okay. Then. That's so, so I feel so this like means gross. More. this this means Everybody more poops. to our relationship. Uh, Emily's a big time shitter. I am apparently. not a big time shitter. Coffee oh, gets her going. She's taking I the was... crown, man. Oh, you really? Shit more than yeah. four? You did. That is so you not do. true. Well, we're starting to figure out where she disappears to all the time. I Seriously, didn't. She's I have not gone. pooped today. You just well, holding it in? I have not. No. I, I, <laughs> when you I, took that stroll outside, you didn't go out there, did you? Oh, she, no, t- she took really? an emodium before well, I know you've been known in to your, do that. In your, in your garden? And you've, you've been known to do that at I, your I house. I've not been known. I've at never taken house. a shit at my house outside. <laughs> You're full of it. Yeah, that's a, that's a big one. That's a big yeah. moment for everyone. Even farting in front of your Ooh, other yeah. one for the yeah. first time, that's a lot. There's there's a, there's a quite a few uh, first times when you first start dating that can be pretty awkward. Yeah, there are, and there's a whole list of them. Just to let you know, you're you're not alone. And uh, starting, it starts the first awkward first is actually the first date. Um, trying to get the conversation going on a first date, they say, can be so awkward. I disagree with that. Oh really? You can with people that you don't really have a good chemistry with yeah Mm -hmm. you know uh and then it's then it's brutal it's like pulling teeth but if you immediately connect with somebody to me i find it find it pretty easy and it's easy to hold a conversation and i don't find it that awkward if you're feeling awkward it may not work yeah Yeah. i know i awkwardly the first date i had with you're awkward with everybody i know your conversations with everybody are i know i know especially when i'm like trying too hard oh which is the all the time. Worst it's version of Sky. Oh, it's brutal. Yeah. I re- well, if you recognize it, why don't you well, stop doing it? Because it's like one of those blackout moments. Like when you're in it, you can't like fucking stop it. You know, like it's like a runaway train. You oh, want no. it to, you want it to stop, but you you can't. So you know you're doing it. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's brutal. Yeah. So uh the first date with me and the hubby, um <laughs> Can you remember that far? Seriously. Oh, that was a long time ago. A long time ago. Okay. Long it was, time it ago. It was like 23 years ago. Woo! Okay, everybody. Oh, God. Yeah. Um, I remember. Oh, I was a baby. I remember. <laughs> I, I was. I was opening. I was, a, I was opening a door. He was like sitting on the other side of the room and I opened a door and I was like looking at him, like trying to be like, oh, oh, hey, hey, I'm, hey. Ew. What? what is she doing? I don't know. And I, She's oh, spasming? Well, I, I'm still like <laughs> looking at him. and He immediately canceled the date. <laughs> and I opened the door and I just freaking knock myself in the head okay. with the fucking door. Really? Sky. Like it was so, and then I pretended like it didn't happen. You know what I mean? Like maybe he didn't see me just knock myself in the fucking head with <laughs> oh, the door. Oh my God. So it doesn't have to be conversation that can make the first date awkward. It could be spilling a drink. Trying too hard. Whatever Emily, when it is. you were at the Silver Fox mm. with Robert, yeah. <laughs> crushing the the cigs and the yeah. bourbon. Yeah. Um, <laughs> any awkward moments, or were you guys just too wasted? Or no, that night we were feeling real good, yeah. and so that was not awkward. The conversation was flowing, and when, when you sobered up, yeah, awkward. No, actually, it was always great with him. I remember when we very first started dating, I was going to working on the radio in the mornings, and then I was going to hair school at night at Paul Mitchell. <laughs> and How'd that work out? That was right when not very good. Honestly, I, I may have you cut my son's hair. I honestly would do it. I, 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 I'm, I'm going to risk it because his Ooh, hair... That's risky. Yeah. We can't get it cut, and he's, it's a mess right yeah. now. It is a mess. He came so to the window I, earlier. And I don't know what like, to do. Yeah. Like, how do, what do we do well, it during these times? Good luck. 
Uh, I've been there, bro. I know. Uh, and and my kid's a model. Oh yeah, the <laughs> agent is going to be crazy. All right, just drop him. Yeah. I think I already have anxiety right now <laughs> thinking about that. That is too much Please on don't the line. Do this. Just forget. Please yeah. don't do this. Yeah. yeah, but I remember he would come over to my house um, in the evening, and we had not sex yet. We waited. I waited. Wait, that's with him. fucking five bullshit. minutes. That's or 10 when minutes? oh, when I like a guy, I waited. Wait a minute. That How was long? always my How thing. Long? So do you never like he guys? We waited three weeks to have sex. <laughs> three. Oh, you know weeks? what? Fuck you. Uh, <laughs> There's no way. Three. Weeks. I don't believe. Oh, uh, I don't oh, believe. And he's this. calling a timeout. I don't out. fucking believe this. Three weeks. Mm-hmm. For real? For real. Why did he stay with you? He heard everything about <gasps> Hey! <laughs> OB Emily. No, like, what the... Wait, so about you're OB saying Emily. the first t- night you guys hung out yeah. was at the Silver Fox in PB, and you were wasted. Mm-hmm. Blow and, job, at least, And right? you didn't mm-hmm. hook up with him. We didn't go home together that night. But you gave him a handy in the in the bathroom. No, I didn't give him a handy <laughs> in the, All the bathroom. All the guys were like, "Dude, what what happened?" No, like, shut up! <laughs> I didn't do that. No, we ended up. He would like come over and we'd walk, go on a walk with my dog and talk, and it was Aww, awesome. True love. And sober too. We, to we wouldn't drink. I know it was crazy. Wow. I don't. Uh, it stunned. doesn't make sense. I'm I know. Stunned. I'm stunned wow. that it happened too. Looking back at it as well. <laughs> wow. To be honest, that poor bastard. He had to take all that Cialis. And he just couldn't have any relief I mean, for it. That's brutal. <laughs> what? Wow. Just walking around with a boner. <laughs> yeah. <That's> First, <laughs> now, you and Haley didn't really date. No. You guys talked on the phone and you would send sex videos. Just talk about, you know, sucking titties and shit like that. Oh, you yeah. know it, bro. That a boy. Well, but, but that, that and like, uh, yeah, that. But then when like, but she lived in NorCal, so I didn't see her that much. I saw her once a month because she would drive down. I never drove to her. <laughs> she oh, still God. resents. And she still resents me for that. Nope. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Yeah, you She's, could. She still, uh, yeah, you physically couldn't do it. Could On a weekend? Do it. Yeah, I couldn't do it. Yeah. Absolutely could. Well, her aunt lived down You're here. You're the most selfish bastard no, I've ever met That's in my not life. Her, her, and God. she was probably selling, sending amazing titty oh, yeah. pictures. I was sending nice nice pictures. Oh, oh, God. I was working out at the time. I look good, baby. So what were you sending? Not your dick. Yeah. I was sending dick pics. And his weird balls. But it wasn't yours. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's so, that meme. Well, that's her going aunt lived. Her, yeah. <laughs> her aunt lived down here, so she would stay with her aunt too. When she, because I was really weird at first about having her stay with me. Because oh, I, remember he was in commitment phobia yeah. guy. I don't, I, don't I don't have a girlfriend. I don't have, even though yeah. I'm only talking to one girl specifically over and over again. Yeah. Yeah, that guy. Then when she stayed, <laughs> then when she moved down here, mm-hmm. we started dating, and then it was like, uh, it was weird because we. I was doing things that I would do before that were, were awkward now. It was like... Like what? You know what I mean? No, I don't. Like when we first were hooking up and it wasn't a big deal, yeah. I didn't care. So I'd walk around naked. I took a shit. It didn't bother me. Oh, then when she moved down here, I like changed all that and it became like we were like first dating again. Whoa. Isn't that oh. weird? That is weird. Backwards. Isn't that weird? I, I didn't sleep like with that. her for three weeks. <laughs> Make fun of Emily. Oh. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what so. are some other awkward moments, guy? Uh, okay. Next, after the first date, we got the first kiss. Do we go tongue? Do we not go tongue? Which way are their heads going? Which way is your head going? Is this a hug? Is this a kiss? Lots to work Try to make it, it magical, up. man. Who doesn't go tongue when they kiss? Well, you, that's first, so. First of all, so Sky just raised her hand. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, a first kiss may just be a quick, you know, lip on lip. Kiss like a good without guy. tongue, you know. <laughs> Why are you doing that? Can you what? stop being I'm so weird? I'm trying to not make it awkward. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I, uh, I guess what, I get what you're saying. I get you know what, what I mean. It might, like, might be kind of quick. Yeah. You know, like it's not a full makeout sesh. Right. You know, sometimes. I don't, I'm not saying shove your tongue down the person's throat oh either. God. But you know, okay, I get what you're saying. Got a, got a little slippage. No. Oh, you gotta slip it in a little bit, Sky. She's like, oh, wants to God. vomit. Oh, Come on, Sky. It feels good. I, I feel like there's so many teeth in my mouth right now that I'm oh, banging just from teeth. Thor? Yeah, like Thor banging. talking about the tongue kiss. It's like, I feel like That's he does. my tongue. I feel like he does oh, a helicopter God. thing with his tongue in my mouth. <laughs> I don't do that. I feel like I don't, you do. I, don't I feel do like that. you do. And, and I mean, if I mean pussy, then. Hey. Whoa. And Eddie, your tongue would not fit in anyone's mouth. That's so true. don't try and pretend like it's That is. I feel like I might choke. Yeah, seriously. You will choke oh wow eddie (laughs) uh the next awkward moment is the first sleepover am i supposed to spend the night am Mm. i supposed to usually what happens is you kind of both sort of pass out you don't really want it to happen Mm -hmm. but then it did and you're like oh fuck now i'm committed yeah Yeah. you know and then you can't go back you can't go back yeah once you have one sleepover it's done (sighs) man i remember hating the sleepover 
I never wanted anybody to sleep over, and I never wanted to sleep over for a while. Because of your weirdness? Because I'm so anxiety ridden. And I remember. In <laughs> would you just lie there stiff as a board? Oh, like I bet you my would. stomach turning into itself. Uh, more shitting. So fucking nervous. <laughs> just like worried, like, oh my God, what if I have to go to the bathroom? What if I have to. Oh, like, sleep like, hard. I don't know what I'm going to do. Like, I was freaking out. Like, I, mean, I hated how that. How weird that you would overthink that. I yeah. remember always coming up with excuses and telling guys to leave. Like, if it was a guy that I've been seeing for a little so bit. So every day? I mean, really? That's a lot really? of excuses. Yeah, I was fucking different guys every day. That's a wow. lot of excuses. Just what's happening. Wow. Your, those are your words, wow. not mine. Wow, Emily, <laughs> that's crazy. Uh, the first sex, they say, can be awkward. Uh, you know, some people try not if too you're hard. Uh, yeah, mm. not if you're schmammered. But some people try too hard. Some people have a little bit of anxiety issues uh -oh. going <laughs> this guy's on. Nodding Listen, his head towards uh -oh. Thor. I was 20 when I got sober, so I've been having sober sex for a really long time. Ew. And the first, few, you know, the first couple times when you're young in your 20s, it's it's tough. You get anxious. Mm. And I got, no, I got, daddy doesn't have out? any medicine. No? No. He's hiding in there? <laughs> Look, <laughs> oh, no. I I him, the average guy was just hiding a little Thor, bit. Thor has an innie. <laughs> no, okay, I don't have an innie. <laughs> yeah, so the first sex is awkward. They say the first P is awkward as well. Really? The first time you ask to use the restroom at someone's house because you feel like if you ask to use the restroom, they just assume you're shitting. Yeah. Right. right. No. So. It, I kind of agree with that because then you got the situation you have with uh, Sky where you don't really want to hear, let yeah. them hear you pee. Can you hear me Weird. pee? And, and I remember this one chick that I was hooking up with had the weirdest bathroom ever that I've ever seen. What do you mean? She, in, it was like a one bedroom. It was like a studio, honestly. It was really okay. small. And her bathroom had above where the ceiling is and where the wall would be. It was all open oh. up there. And so you could hear everything. Yeah. Oh, God, that's Fuck the worst. That. I know exactly what you're and talking I went, about. That. I went, oh, my God. Like, not only do I have to pee, I really have to fart. <gasps> <gasps> and so, uh -uh. Go, you know, that, I thought that would be a perfect, you know, I need, I just go use your bathroom, whatever. And I see that thing, and I'm like, oh, no. Fuck. Just let it yeah. go. Like, what you do I need to do? You can't. You have to hold it in, bro, for the rest of your life. All right, well, I did. Okay, and good. then finally, I made up some weird excuse of why I had to leave. <laughs> and as soon as I got outside, oh. I took a piss on her side yard. And I let the farts fly, man. On her side yard. On the side yard, oh, yeah. Sweet <laughs> relief. Yeah. Oh, it felt so good. <laughs> Uh, the next awkward moment is the first P that they say takes an unexpected turn, um, kind of like your story, but maybe you you're actually having to shit, you know, mm. and that's, that's, so that's basically turns yeah. into the first wow. shit at their house. <laughs> In there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At the same time. <laughs> uh, next is the first miscommunication. In the relationship. Ooh, that can get really awkward. Because and you learn a lot of yes. how people fight. Yes. yes. And I how they handle stuff. Did yep. I say it wrong? Did they hear it wrong? Mm. Who's backing down first? Mm. Like, that yeah. That could be bad. That could be bad. Uh, the first fart. Yeah. That, uh, can, that can get awkward. Do you hold it in? Do you let it the out? The first time my girlfriend farted. Um, we I'm sorry? Were, the first time my girlfriend farted around me, we were having sex. I told you the story. Did I tell you? Oh. I don't remember. Okay, and we were having That's sex, so crazy. and I started to smell something. And I went, <gasps> what the fuck is that smell? And it smelled. And she's like, I don't know. And I'm like, Yeah, you what gotta the blame fuck? like the dog yeah. or the cat so, or something. So I'm like, <laughs> Yeah. So I'm, and the dogs weren't on the bed. You know, Listen, how they're on the bed. If you us? tell me she admitted it, no, 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 that's no. crazy because oh, you can't ever cop to that. No, it's, you can't. It's worse. No, no, no. It's it's worse. Oh God. So I'm looking around and I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, did one of the dogs take a shit? No, like no. that bad? <gasps> it was that. Bad. The hell did she eat? And I'm like, and then she <laughs> she starts helping me look around the bedroom. <laughs> one of the dogs <laughs> taking a shit. Good, that's a good move. And I'm like, that is such a I'm good like, move. I, so then like we, I'm just I'm dumbfounded. The smell's gone. I'm like, all right, so we start having sex again. And then like a week later, she admitted the dogs didn't take a shit. She farted. Why would she bring that why, up? It was why gone. Admit that? Yeah, why why she admit does. that? She does that. She admits stuff that she, she doesn't she need to admit. Uh, yeah. yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, she should no. have seen her. She's, she was like, I don't know. She needs to lie more and lie better. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Sky. Yeah. Take it from Sky stick, and I. Stick thank with you. it. Yeah, yeah definitely. Just go with it. Especially with something like that. I don't need to know. Oh, yeah, you would prefer I didn't, a lie. I don't know why and she told me. And wouldn't you have ignored it if I smell, you know, like fart? Yeah. And I'm fucking. Oh, yes. Eddie, it's stunk. I don't care. I'm still. I'm gonna. I'm gonna nut, and yeah. then maybe Whoa. I'll go. All right, what's going on? Yeah. I'm not no. stop. Time out. Time yeah. out. Eddie, I'm sorry. Where's that shit smell? <laughs> yeah, because you know you're not I gonna thought, start again. I mean, it kills the moment. Mm. Big sigh. I thought Oscar took his shit in the house. It was that bad. <laughs> 
Oh, that's this really so fucking much. gross. What's wrong with so her inside? Yeah. Yeah. Something. Hangs out with me too much. Yeah, I Jeez. guess so. Uh, the next awkward moment, they say, is the first discovery of a rogue body hair. Because, guys, if you find a rogue body hair on your gal, on whether a it's a nipple, oh, yeah. a chin, yes. whatever, you don't realize it's a rogue body hair. You just think it's like a little piece of fuzz or something. Um, get it off. And you try and wipe it off. Or you don't off. know it's connected and you go to yank it yank and it, it, oh, Whoops. Yeah, yeah, that Sorry. that Didn't gets know. that gets really awkward for everyone involved. Mm-hmm. So watch out for that. And the final awkward moment when you first start dating is the first real fight. The oh. first mm-hmm. real one. Not a miscommunication. That's bad. Not a little where do we want to eat dinner? Can't agree. Yeah. Like the first fucking real fight. And like you said, Eddie, you find out how does a person fight? How f- low will they go? And it can get real awkward. My first real fight would have been somebody admitting to farting during sex. <laughs> there you go. I mean, don't fucking tell me that, please. Yes. 